It's a special spot often seen but rarely visited in the heart of the Yolo Bypass Wildlife Area. Beneath Interstate 80 and the Yolo Causeway lives one of Northern California's true wonders. To get here, we caravan with several dozen Sacramento City College students studying environmental biology, driving for miles through the area inhabited by 200 species of birds and covered in rice fields. This is incredibly safe. There's pretty much no predator that can get into those expansion joints. Corky Quirk is the Yolo Basin Foundation's program coordinator, better known as the Bat Lady. She's taken us here at sunset in anticipation of a mass exodus. They come to Sacramento specifically for the heat and the bugs. With bugs swarming in droves, out come the bats, a wave of black flying up to 60 miles per hour on the hunt for mosquitoes, moss, and other pests. It's so weird that it's so close to like an urban city and you can just come and see it right here. The crowd watches from below in awe and wonder, getting over fears along the way. I had a fear of them, but now that I know that they don't really eat blood or they don't really bite, it's totally changed my perspective of them. There are 250,000 Mexican free-tailed bats up here, the largest such colony in all of California. He's trying to catch him and, and eat one. At one point, a red-tailed hawk swoops in, taking away an unlucky bat for dinner. For Quirk, who regularly leads tours here, the display never gets old. Getting to see wildlife in their you know, environment doing their thing is pretty special. We don't get to see that a lot when we live in cities. Though typically hidden in the warm and protected underbelly of a well-traveled interstate, they're now out in the open for all to see. In Yolo County, Tom Miller, KCRA 3 News.